Ahead here at noon, a hearing today for the two teens charged after a chase and a deadly crash. A woman was killed in the wreck that happened in Oakland Park in August. Local 10 News reporter Ian Margol was in the court today for one of the hearings and joins us live from Fort Lauderdale. Ian? Yeah, one of those teens appeared this morning. The other one will appear in just about an hour from now. That crash, as we mentioned, happened back in August after those two teens allegedly went to a home here in Fort Lauderdale, broke in, then stole a Mercedes and led police on a chase. That chase, though, then ended with this crash that involved three different vehicles and killed a 35-year-old mother, Maria Tales Vaderrabano. The teens, 13-year-old Jacory Flournoy and 15-year-old Jacoby Besant, fled the scene of the crash but were later taken into custody. They are now facing serious charges and the state is working on determining if they will be tried as adults. This morning in court, the defense asked for 21 more days, though, to do more behavioral testing for Jacoby. And only moments after they asked for that extension, he demonstrated why his attorney is so concerned. I want to make sure that she is able to provide us with a very thorough assessment so that the state has that thorough assessment to make their decision. You're seriously laughing right now? We are dealing with a 15-year-old. Unfortunately, that's part of the reason why I want the state to have more of a snapshot of him because he is very immature. All right, October 31st. Take him out, please. I, don't, I can't have him in here. Take him out. So as you heard, Judge Stacy Ross was so frustrated by his outburst, by his laughing in court, that she actually kicked Jacoby out of the courtroom. His family was sitting there. had to He had to walk right out in front of them, being led out by people from the Department of Juvenile Corrections. He was reset to come back into court on October 31st. However, Jacory, he will have his hearing today at 1.30. We do expect to hear whether or not the state is going to be charging him as an adult. We'll keep you posted every step of the way. Live in Fort Lauderdale, me and Margot, Local 10 News.